Just 10 days after the fiery spectacle of Starship Flight 3, SpaceX President Gwen Shotwell has ignited the engines of excitement once more, announcing Flight 4. This news isn't just about another launch. It's a testament to the relentless spirit of innovation that burns bright within SpaceX. While some might have viewed the previous flight as a setback, SpaceX sees it as a thrilling chapter in their ongoing odyssey, a chapter filled with invaluable data and lessons learned. The rapid turnaround between flights stands in stark contrast to the glacial pace of traditional space agencies. Here, years morph into decades as rockets meticulously inch toward their launch pads. SpaceX, however, operates on a different timeline, one measured in weeks and fueled by a relentless pursuit of progress. It's a testament to their audacious goals championed by the visionary Elon Musk himself and their unwavering belief in the power of continuous improvement. This philosophy is embedded in the very core of SpaceX's culture. Making life multiplanetary. We're doing a lot of good things at SpaceX. I mean, Starlink is incredible. Falcon 9 is the, the primary lift vehicle, launch vehicle for, for Earth. Failure is not an ending, but a stepping stone, a chance to learn, adapt and improve. It's this embrace to failure, this constant iteration that allows SpaceX to push the boundaries of what's possible at an incredible pace. Meet the crew, Ship 29 and Booster 11 take the stage. Imagine yourself standing at the launch pad, the ground trembling slightly with anticipation. Floodlights bathe the scene in an ethereal glow, revealing Ship 29 in all its magnificent glory. This gleaming metallic marvel, a testament to countless engineering breakthroughs, stretches an astonishing 160 feet 49 meters skyward. With a diameter of 30 feet or 9 meters, it resembles a colossal silver arrow primed to pierce the veil of the atmosphere and carry humanity's dreams into the cosmos. The spaceship is currently undergoing testing as per Elon Musk and will be ready soon for launch. This isn't just any arrow though. This is a marvel of modern engineering honed through countless hours of testing and simulation. Previously, static fire tests designed to meticulously check every system and ensure flawless operation before launch could take weeks. It was a painstaking process necessary to ensure the safety of the crew and the success of the mission. But SpaceX, ever the innovator, has revolutionized this process. Through a combination of ingenious design and rigorous pre-flight checks, they've streamlined the process, shaving the test time down to a mere handful of seconds. Every shaped second translates to cost savings, a crucial factor in making space travel more accessible for the future. Imagine the thunderous roar as the engines ignite for the first time, a symphony of fire and fury that shakes the very ground beneath your feet. For a split second, a plume of intense orange flame engulfs the base of the ship, then dissipates to reveal a swirling vortex of hot exhaust, a testament to the immense power harnessed within. The cheers of the engineers in the control room erupt as all systems confirm nominal operation. The arrow is ready to fly. Now, shift your gaze to the other half of this dynamic duo, Booster 11. Towering over 230 feet or 70 meters tall, this behemoth is a force to be reckoned with. Its steel muscles are clad in gleaming white skin, and its powerful heart, a cluster of 33 Raptor engines, lies concealed within its core. These next-generation high-performance engines are the true workhorses of the operation. Each Raptor engine is capable of generating an astonishing 230,000 pounds of thrust, and all 33 of them working in concert produce a combined thrust of 17.1 million pounds. That's the equivalent of lifting 17.1 million pounds straight off the ground, enough power to launch a small skyscraper into space. Imagine the raw, untamed power coursing through this metal giant as the engines ignite. The ground trembles violently, a cacophony assaults your ears, and the very air seems to crackle with energy. This is the primordial roar of humanity's ambition taking flight. But the journey to the stars is never a smooth one. Flight 3, while undeniably dramatic, wasn't without its challenges. The malfunctioning payload bay doors, designed to protect the precious cargo during the ascent, 
and the damage sustained by the booster during the launch pad avoidance maneuver are just a few bumps on this cosmic highway. However, these setbacks aren't roadblocks, they're stepping stones. Engineers are already dissecting the data from Flight 3, implementing improvements to the design of the payload bay doors and ensuring a more controlled descent for Booster 11. They're constantly learning, adapting and evolving, all in pursuit of a flawless Starship launch. Competition to NASA Market Share in Launch Services Starship, if successful, has the potential to disrupt the launch service market traditionally dominated by government agencies like NASA. By offering a fully reusable and potentially cheaper launch system, SpaceX could attract customers away from NASA for missions that don't require the specific capabilities of NASA's launch vehicles. Lunar Exploration Ambitions Both NASA and SpaceX have shown interest in returning humans to the moon. Starship's reusability and potential payload capacity could pose a challenge to NASA's Artemis program if it proves to be a more cost-effective and efficient way to establish a lunar base. Public Perception and Funding If SpaceX achieves significant milestones with Starship, it could capture the public imagination and potentially influence future space exploration funding decisions. This could lead to more resources being allocated to private space agencies like SpaceX and potentially impacting NASA's budget and capabilities. Focus of these launches The focus of the launch remains, and according to the president of SpaceX, the main focus would be in re-entry and accurate landing of these machines. Not only that, learning from the previous failed rocket launches and making the process efficient would be a key achievement. The goal of these launches are to reach orbit and deploy satellites. There's also a big talk regarding catching the boosters as well. Beyond the machine, the human spirit at the helm. The true magic of Starship lies not just in the marvel of engineering that is Ship 29 and Booster 11, but in the human spirit that propels them forward. At the forefront of this endeavor stands Gwen Shotwell, President and COO of SpaceX. Her leadership style is a potential blend of calculated risk-taking, meticulous attention to detail, and a relentless drive for excellence. Shotwell fosters a collaborative environment where engineers, technicians, and dreamers from all walks of life work together, their diverse perspectives fueling groundbreaking solutions. Her belief in absurd goals, audacious objectives that push the boundaries of what's considered achievable has become a cornerstone of SpaceX's culture. These seemingly impossible goals serve a crucial purpose. They inspire innovation and ignite passion within the team. A fiery spectacle ignites not just the launch pad, but the spirit of innovation. Ten days after a dramatic dance with the cosmos, Starship embarks on a new odyssey. This steel symphony, a testament to human ambition, stands poised to pierce the celestial veil. Its journey, however, isn't a solitary flight. Booster 11, a colossus of raw power, stands as its faithful companion. Together, they form a mechanical ballet, a testament to the relentless pursuit of progress. The echoes of past challenges, the malfunctioning doors, and fiery descent linger in the air. But these are not defeat, but stepping stones. The human spirit embodied by the visionary Shotwell thrives on audacious goals, those seemingly impossible dreams that fuel the fire of innovation. Starship is more than just metal and engines. It's a canvas for humanity's yearning to explore, a testament to the boundless potential that lies within us. And as it reaches for the stars, it carries not just dreams, but a future where the cosmos is no longer a distant spectacle, but a tangible reality.